Hello and welcome to the weekly GFI Sunbelt Malware Minute. My name is Tom Kelschner. Last week, alert reader Marco tipped us off to a website loaded with 10 landing pages used to poison search results for the Chile Mine Rescue Story. The real agenda was to scam you into installing a rogue security product. Any of the links redirected a victim's browser to a site that would download the security tool Rogue. Chris Boyd, our man in the UK, found a link being pinged around various chat rooms that tried to lure users with the offer of a mobile version of Twitter. The page was a fish located on a free web host. The point? It was an attempt to grab some high-profile Twitter accounts and use them for malicious purposes. Some federal agencies issued a pair of advisories about money mule scams. The U.S. Secret Service, the FBI, the Internet Crime Complaint Center, and Financial Services Information Sharing and Analysis Center addressed the first to job seekers telling them how to avoid becoming a money mule. The second was for small and medium-sized businesses warning them of the bank account takeovers that use mules to send stolen cash offshore. The anti-phishing working group has estimated that the scams could cost U.S. companies a billion dollars in losses this year. And for aspiring Malcode analysts, we blogged a list of good reference books on malicious code, Malcode analysis, and reverse engineering.